Hello, everybody. Today's story is called Ocean Meets Sky, and it's by the Fan Brothers. Awesome illustrations. Ocean Meets Sky. Finn lived by the sea, and the sea lived by him. It's a good day for sailing, his grandfather would have said. Finn remembered Grandpa's voice, telling him stories about a place far away where the ocean meets the sky. His grandfather would have been 90 years old today. To honor him, Finn built a boat, a boat fit for a long journey, one they had planned together. Boat building was hard work. Finn took a short nap below decks. When he awoke, he felt the, bo the boat rocking gently beneath him. The journey had begun. Can you see there's little shapes in the sky? It's a whale, a bird, a boat, a pipe, an elephant, and an anchor. I didn't think the open sea would feel so lonely, Finn said after some time. This caught the attention of a great golden fish. Do you know where the ocean meets sky? Finn asked the fish. It's high and low and as deep as the sea, the fish answered in a voice that made Finn's boat shake. It's up and down and very far. I can show you the way. He followed the golden fish to the library islands where a hundred bookish birds were roosting. Then they explored an island of giant shells. and crossed a sea of moon jellies dancing. But then Finn's eyes filled with wonder. Had he finally reached the place of his grandfather's stories? The magical place where ocean meets sky? His boat began to lift from the water or had the water fallen away? golden fish swam toward the moon. Finn followed. He wanted to say goodbye. He had so many questions, but he heard a voice calling to him from far away. Finn! Finn, wake up! It's time for dinner, said his mother. I made grandpa's dumplings. Finn looked out across the sea to that magical, far away place where ocean meets sky. It had been a good day for sailing. The end. I hope you enjoyed Ocean Meets Sky. Have a great day.